US President Donald Trump says that he would not sure of having a meeting with, with Russian counterpart Vladimir Putin in Paris where the two leaders are scheduled to attack 1211 commemorations later this week however they would be meeting at G20 summit in Argentina which is scheduled for November 30 and December 1 The rules championed by Democratic former President Barack Obama instead of to intended to safeguard equal access to content on the internet were opposed by Trump a Republican the net neutrality repeals was opposed by internet companies like Facebook Amazon and Alphabet INC Jury in the Auckland court will begin hearing argument later today in the job discrimination lawsuit against TCS. The IT firm is accused of discrimination against Americans by favoring Indian experts and visa ready workers from India of US position TCS has denied all the charges against it. The US want companions globally that they would be subject to several penalties if they continued to have sanctionable commercial transaction with Iran as it triggered the noises around the Iran regimes with a set of thoughts ever American sanction. Facebook had blocked some 30 accounts on its platform and 85 accounts on photo sharing social network Instagram over concern they may be linked to foreign entities and aim to interfering in US midterm elections. Prime Minister Justin Trudeau wanted his government's and new legislation on pay equity at conference of female business leaders in Montreal on Monday and was pressed about how Canada will respond to the major corporate tax reforms in US. San Francisco Xavier University says that crypto coin mining was the culprit behind the attempt of cyber attack that forced the schools to shut down its network for 4 days last week. Cryptocurrency mining is a process by which digital currency transaction is are recorded, verified and stored in public ledger called blockchain. The newly struck Northern American Trade Agreement will lead more American dairy product into Canada and while it has yet to refine it, it's already putting at least one MP from the governing Liberals in a awkward spot. Conservation officer Matthew Cobert shot and killed a grizzly bear after its attack a man near the wild cliff and then charged him. Cobert, three other conservation officer and contract houseman and several dogs were dispatched to find the bear and kill it a facebook video showing a verbal altercation between a group of men and rcmp officers in creating a huge amount of backlash on social media according to the rcmp two members originally responded but called a backup when a 10 men shooting off a firework became aggressive Subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so you can get latest videos and this is absolutely free